I've been studying great apes for about 20 years in East Africa. I find these animals to be the most fascinating creatures on earth other than humans. When I came to the realization that the animals that I've studied for so many years are rapidly disappearing, I decided that it was time to raise public awareness by writing this book. In writing Planet Without Apes, I, I tried to do a couple things. First of all, I tried to explain to people what these animals are all about. Who are they? There are only four great ape species, the chimpanzee, the bonobo, the gorilla in Africa, and then the orangutan in Asia. And these four great apes, which share a number of anatomical features with humans, and in particular they share our big brains, these are our closest kin. And whereas there are seven billion of us, there are a combined total of those four species, only a couple of hundred thousand great apes left in the wild. And those numbers are rapidly plummeting. Orangutans live only in Indonesia and a few isolated places in Borneo and Sumatra. Their forests are being rapidly cleared for plantations by the Indonesian government. Meanwhile, gorillas in Africa, they're eaten widely as food, they're hunted. Now that it's become a commercial industry with smuggling networks all over the world, it's an enormous problem. We know that in Brussels, in Paris, in London, and New York, there's a black market for bushmeat that's been smuggled in about the ton every year out of Africa. So in the 21st century, we're dealing with an enormous biodiversity crisis. We're dealing with species disappearing every day and every year. And people wonder, well, you know, so, so what? So how, how much should we really care about this? The argument that I make about great apes is that these are our cousins. We've grown up learning about them, regarding them as kind of mirrors that we look into to learn something about ourselves. So letting them disappear would be very much like having a close relative who is in danger in some way and then not bothering to help. So I wrote Planet Without Apes as a way to let everybody know that these four species, chimpanzee, bonobo, gorilla, and orangutan, are all in really grave and imminent danger of extinction within not just our grandchildren's lifetimes, but within our lifetimes.